Hey everybody, what's up? My name's Danny. I own a fashion resale business called Thriftfish, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, I am putting out a what's old fast. Uh, I usually do it by month, but since I missed uh, March, I'm going to do a combined video for March and April. It is May, it's almost June. Uh, but, you know, things have been a little crazy busy around here, but still wanted to make sure I got this video out because it is one of my absolute favorites to make and I know that you guys like these too. They seem to perform one of the best on my channels. So if you're not subscribed already and you're interested in reselling videos, go ahead and subscribe and remember to hit the thumbs up button so I know that you liked it. Okay, so we are going to stick with, it's like 22 items that sold fast and uh, in that case, that is within 12 days and then we go down from there to all the way to within the same day. Uh, this is only Poshmark sales. I just kind of pull the sales report and report back and it's kind of easy that way. Uh, but I also list on eBay and a little bit on Grailed. Uh, anyway, and then I like to flip the script and do uh, my slowest selling items. Uh, so I usually do five, but it looks like I have six because two of them were the same like day amount. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and get started with the things that sold fast. There's a lot of really fun brands and really fun things on this list. The first of which is a pair of Clove Core Classic Night Shift uh, black nursing shoes. So these are like for healthcare professionals. I mean, they're just comfortable shoes. Anyone can wear them, but they are styled for like nurses and other healthcare workers. Uh, so that's a good brand. I like to keep my eye out for them. This is the first time I think I've found them at the thrift store. Um, and uh, they sold after 12 days of being listed. I think the fan is like blowing my camera and like, so you're just gonna have like a wobbly video the whole time. Hold on. We don't want that. I don't know, unless that's soothing to you. Okay. <laughs> And that'll probably be quieter too. Okay, next up, oh, before I move on though, uh, those sold for $38, uh, $2.02 .02 shipping discount, so I got $28.38. Next up was a pair of Torrid uh, five inch classic distressed denim shorts. These are the backstage shorts. I believe I got these at the bins. Uh, my friend Courtney, Courtney uh, gave me a bunch of stuff from Torrid. I saw her at the bins and she was super sweet to give me those items. They were new with tags. They sold for $26 after 12 days, uh, 202 shipping discount. So I got 1878. Next up, one of my favorite brands to find and sell, MM LaFleur. It usually does really well. Sold after 11 days of being listed. Uh, this was a the Wells one button blazer jacket. Super cute, just a black, really cute blazer. Uh, sold for $50 with a $2.98 shipping discount. I got $37.02. The next item had the same price. Uh, the next item sold after 10 days and it was an Everlane item, but I love Everlane's cashmere. Um, the value of a lot of their stuff has gone down, but I love finding the cashmere. This was the oversized Stroop Waffle Turtleneck in Re Cashmere. Again, sold for $50, $2.98 shipping discount. So I got $37.02, just like the last one. The next one was a new with tags, naked wardrobe. This is fun. One shoulder glitter cutout jumpsuit in black. Uh, sold after 10 days of being listed. And it sold for $40 with a $2.02 shipping dis discount, leaving me with $29.98. Uh, I think that's a fun brand. Again, it doesn't have like a super high resale value, but it's like a popular brand. Uh, I think it sells fairly fast and it gets a lot of attention, especially those glitzy like one piece uh, items, super trendy. Okay, next up, I posted about this brand on my Instagram and I've been seeing it kind of floating around, Vivaya. Uh, they look a lot like Rothy's, but they're kind of their own thing. Yes, they're very similar style that like knit shoe, uh, they also claim to be like non-smelling, like they have some sort of herb in them to help them not smell. Uh, but I've been finding these and flipping them and I love them. These sold after 10 days. They're the Jenny black round toe slip on sneakers sold for 55, 298 shipping discount. So I got 4102. A maternity brand is next, Blanky, B-L-A-N-Q-I. 
uh, just a, oh, I did this as a set. I found a tank top and a pair of leggings in the same size, uh, white tank top, like a pinkish legging. So I lauded them up together and they sold after six days. Wow, we jumped from 10 to six days. Sold together for $38, 202 shipping discount. I got 28.38. Again, those items don't necessarily sell super high on their own. So I was willing to lot those up together and sell them as a cute set. Uh, okay, next up, Lily Pulitzer. I love picking up Lily Pulitzer. Um, definitely not my own personal style, but the people who love it, love it. This was the Skipper Underwater Adventure Popover. Half, half zip, my, my, like, my words are not coming out today. Sold for $30 after six days of being listed. No shipping discount, so I got $24. Uh, another cashmere piece, but this time it's made well. After five days of being listed, this sold. It was an orange cashmere cropped v-neck sweater. Sold for $40, uh, 202 shipping discount. So I got $29.98. Okay, now we're kind of coming into the really fast stuff. So after four days, we have another pair of Avaya. Uh, the black Aria pointed toe ballet flats. Sold for $34, no shipping discount. So I got $27.20. The next item was a swim bottom, a pair of swim bottoms. I think I got these from the bins as well. As a pair of Show Me Your Moo Moo Bali Tropics Palm Swim Bikini Bottoms in a size extra large. Those sold after four days for $29, no shipping discount. So I got $23.20, I will take it. It's only the bottoms, no top. Next up, after three days, we have a pair of Girlfriend Collective black high-waisted compression leggings, just their straight, run-of-the-mill compression leggings. Um, again, I don't think these are selling for super high anymore, but again, people are still looking for them. Uh, sold for $25, no shipping discount, so I got 20. Another one of my favorite brands to find, and I found these at the bins as well. M. Jemmy, couldn't believe it. A pair of really cute Feliz Pink Suede Moccasin Driving Loafers, uh, and they sold for $50 after two days of being listed, so very fast. 298 shipping discount, so I got 37.02. Okay, this one was a really fun find. Uh, I've never found this brand in the wild before. It was one of those, I don't know how to say it, Fjall Raven, Fjall, never mind. You know what I'm talking about, I'll put it on the screen. Uh, one of their backpacks, uh, really nice, had some leather detailing, it's like a laptop bag. Uh, this sold after one, oh no, I skipped something. I'll go back because I'm already halfway through this one. But this sold after one day of being listed for $72, had a $2.98 shipping discount and I got $54.62. So that one was really great. Happy about that. Okay, the one I skipped sold after two days. Um, so I got ahead of myself, but it was an UGG. It's like brand UGG. <laughs> Light gray Heidi three, four, three quarter sleeve. Henley cotton lounge romper. So it's just a cute round, oh my gosh, lounge romper. If it was a size larger, if it was my size, I probably would have kept it, but I did source this from my friend, Nicole. She was having a Poshmark sale to liquidate some things. So I grabbed this. It sold again, like I said, after two days for $28, 202 shipping discount. I got $20 and 38 cents, a quick flip. Okay, uh, again, another brand I love, but don't find very often. Veja, V-E-J-A. These were the Esplar White Babe Blush Canvas Lace-Up Low Top Sneakers. Uh, they sold after one day of being listed for $60 with a $2.98 shipping discount, leaving me with $45.02. So again, happy with that one. And another one, <laughs> I think if, uh, there, there are a lot of brands that I have a hard time like answering the question, if you could only sell one brand, what would it be? Uh, but this is one of the ones that I would pick, Frank and Eileen. This was uh, a pair of pants, the Wicklow Washed Black Italian Twill Chino Pant, um, sold within one day of being listed, sold for $115, uh, 298 shipping discount, leaving me with 8902. That's a good sale for me if I ever saw one. <laughs> okay. And then moving on, we have four more items and they all sold the same day they were listed. So first, and I couldn't really believe this because I have a hard time sometimes with Rebecca Taylor stuff, but uh, this Silk Floral Hydrangea Tie Neck Sleeveless White Blouse, 
did sell the same day it was listed for $35, 202 shipping discount. I got $25.98. Uh, then <laughs> the next one is another great brand that I absolutely love. I've only found it twice, but again, I would pick it up again and again. It sells quickly. People want it. It's a great men's brand. It's called Roback. Uh, it's like a technical brand. You know, you can golf, you can do your activities and, you know, feel cool or whatever in like both ways, like temperature cool and whatever. <laughs> anyway, Roback is a deep sea blue polka dot quarter zip Q-zip pullover in a size extra large. Sold same day for $70, uh, $2.98 shipping discount. I got $53.02. Uh, next item that sold the same day was a pair of Aloe Yoga Dark Gray Urban Moto Sweatpant Joggers. Um, Aloe I'm picky with. I like to not, I kind of stay away from the older things, but it feels like a newer style. Um, a really good condition and like maybe more of a jogger or a sweatshirt or a jacket, something like that. Maybe not just like old, an old pair of leggings, probably leave that behind. Uh, but this pair of joggers sold for $35 with a 202 shipping discount. So I got $25.98. And the last item that sold after one day of being listed, or no, sorry, the same day of being listed was a pair of mother jeans. These were the Runaway Skinny Boot Cut Flare ink and paper jeans. They sold for $50, no shipping discount, so just outright, and I got $40. So that was between March and April, so a lot of fun highlights to go over. Um, but we have a couple of lowlights as well, which, you know, I like to see both sides, but not all slow sales are necessarily bad sales. So let's dive into that because the first item here sold after 87 days of being listed, but it was like kind of a higher ticket item. I didn't get as much for it as I would have liked to. That's okay. It was still a nice sale. This is a beholden dress. I actually bought this dress for a wedding that I was in. Uh, it was the Marceau black crepe high neck tulip hem dress. It sold, like I said, after 87 days and it sold for $63. There was a $2.98 shipping discount. I got $47.42. Next up, a very basic item. So it makes sense is why this one also didn't sell until after 87 days of being listed. It was a standard James purse, which some of those items I really like from that brand. Others, a basic tee, probably gonna sit. Uh, this is a black stripe cotton linen blend short sleeve tee. Sold for $27, no shipping discount, so I got $21.60. Honestly, for a plain tee, I'll take it. Okay, next up was a men's item. Sold after 92 days of being listed. I have a lot of like pretty nice men's stuff kind of just hanging out in my closet. I used to have a lot more, but it's slowly trickling out. This item is no exception to that. Uh, and it was also new with tags, sold for $48, $2.98 shipping discount. I got $35.42. Um, I guess I'm not, yeah, for a t-shirt. Oh yes, this was just a, okay. I know exactly what this was. So I'm not, I'm not unhappy with that sale uh, after that amount of time as well. So, okay. Next up, another higher ticket item. I also had it listed pretty high, but it did have some like things in it. Like, you know, you could tell that it used to have like the, um, like kind of like the boob tape on the inside, the sticky stuff to keep it up. Um, but everything about it was noted in the listing. Um, actually, when I found this dress, somebody had like sewn a strapless bra into it. So I had to like snip it out. But the brand is Cushney. Great brand, high end, very expensive. This was a really cute black strapless bustier mini dress. Uh, it took 93 days to sell, but you know, with those kind of items, that's not surprising. Sold for $120. Uh, I did give free shipping, so I got $88.03. Not the higher tier of what you could probably make on a cushiony dress, depending on what you're doing with it. But again, sometimes we're just taking things and moving on. Um, and at this time, $120 for me is okay. Uh, especially when I'm thrifting these items for uh, between, se oh, I didn't mean to do that between like seven and $12. Okay, so this item, holy crap, the last item is so long. <laughs> the next item was a pair of Terez 
uh, sparkle confetti ombre print yoga leggings. Um, just kind of a basic pair of Terra's leggings. And I've slowed down on picking up Terra's uh, just because those sat for so long. They did sell for $25, no shipping discount, so I got 20. That's not too bad. Um, but the last pair of shoes, I don't know. I thought they'd sell. They were Aquatalia. This says I have had them for 537 days. I think I've had them longer because I probably at least relisted them once. That's a long time. We jumped from 100 days to 537 days. It was uh, Aquatalia, a pair of Hattie tan suede espadrille slip-on shoes. Uh, they sold for $32. They had a 202 shipping discount. So I got $23.58. Again, um, I got those a long time ago. So probably not what I was thinking for those, but I'm still not disappointed. Um, I'm happy to move them along. So that's it. Those are my slowest and fastest sales from March and April of 2023 on Poshmark. Uh, I should probably be coming out with the May video soon. Also want to put out some other things on the channel. Just, it's a slower time right now for me and YouTube. Um, but stay tuned. There will be more. Uh, there usually always is. But again, if you haven't subscribed, do that so you can be on the lookout for the videos. And if you like this one, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much and I will see you soon.